both the CRX and the RX7. Okay, they were fun cars to drive. Fun cars to drive, Cheryl. This time of year is freaky with deer here. They pop up anywhere and everywhere. Yeah, yeah. Yesterday, a couple of days ago, we were driving. We almost again almost hit a deer on the highway. And man, gang, I'm an animal lover, really. But deers are the dumbest, dumbest, dumbest animals out there. They see a car coming, they freeze, right? Supposedly, if you see a deer on the highway when you're driving and they stop in front of you, blink your headlights, and the blinking lights is supposed to kick him out of their hypnosis and they'll run, right? But when a deer comes, and a lot of animals actually do this, even squirrels do this, when you see them, they'll freeze right because they think when they freeze you won't see them because a lot of predators um, function their their visuals function on motion right so if you freeze the predator won't be able to recognize you because you're not moving right so they consider I guess cars to be predators and they freeze now freezing in front of a car moving at 120 130 140 kilometers per hour or 100 clicks per hour is not a good idea especially if the drivers are not in you know that experienced so suppose we blinking your headlights works but super dangerous Cheryl super dangerous deers take out a lot of people uh, on highways so when you see deer crossing signs on the highway pay attention those deer crossing or moose crossing or any animal crossing signs they're there because most likely someone has died on that highway and there's been a lot of accidents on that highway right in that zone where there's a deer crossing or whatever animal crossing so they only put up those signs there is because that is a pathway for the animals to go right so pay attention road signs mean something okay uh, be aware be aware 